This video is part of our Parallels Tech Byte series. In this video, we'll demonstrate how you can granularly control multiple displays with the Parallels RAS client for Windows. Parallels RAS provides you with the ability to control which displays to use when inside a remote session. Using the Parallels RAS client, you're able to select one or more displays, easily identify them, and even control which display should be the primary display inside the remote session. This video demonstrates how to use this feature. As you can see, the Parallels RAS client for Windows is already opened, and we have authenticated and retrieved a list of published resources. In this case, it's a list of published desktops coming from VDI, RDSH, as well as Azure Virtual Desktop, including a variety of different published applications. To control multiple displays in a remote session, go to File, Connection Properties, and open the Display tab. On this tab, you can control display settings related to color, published applications, as well as published desktops. To change the display configuration for the published desktop, click on the drop down list and select to use all displays, just a primary local display, or in this case, a selected number of displays. Now click the configuration button to control which displays are used inside the remote session. As you can see, there currently is only one display available and we can of course identify which display that is. When adding another display to Windows by extending to an additional monitor, this is immediately reflected inside the configuration. Now select any number of displays you want to use. To change the primary display of the remote session, simply click on the desired display and select Set Primary. The white bar on the bottom of the display icon represents the start menu and shows that display number 2 is now the primary display inside the remote session. This feature provides extended support and flexibility for multi-monitor scenarios by providing granular control over multiple displays inside a remote session. This concludes our video on demonstrating how to control multiple displays with the Parallels RAS client for Windows. For more content, subscribe to our channel and browse to the Parallels TechBytes series.